24 hours in Paris. So what can you do exactly in 24 hours in Paris? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nora and I'm an expat model YouTuber living in Paris, France. And I've been wanting to make a video like this for a while now. And I saw a couple of people, I saw a couple of tourists showing on YouTube what they do exactly in 24 hours in Paris. I saw a lot of people doing this type of videos who only come here for 24 hours, who only come to Paris for a layover and I thought hmm why not do something similar except the fact that I want to do something that a tourist wouldn't really do here. I want to especially do things that tourists wouldn't do here because I am going to show you guys places and bars and restaurants and museums that are not really well known among tourists in Paris. I feel like when foreigners come here they typically only go to like uh, like a couple of places that are specifically are made for tourists. Let's just say that and I understand that a lot of people are interested to see the Louvre, the Eiffel Tower, Les Champs-Élysées, um, but at the same time I kind of wanted to create something that's a bit more like unique I guess, that's a bit more interesting and that you can actually use if you ever come to Paris and you don't want to do all the touristy stuff that everyone else does. <laughs> Before we jump into this video, I just quickly want to mention that I am currently doing one-on-one -on -one consultations with you guys. If you're a foreigner or a student who is interested in moving to Paris or who is interested in studying in France, I'm currently doing one-on-one -on -one one hour zoom calls with you guys. So if you have questions regarding moving to Paris and living abroad, please contact me. My email is down in the description box below. I'm helping expats and foreigners who are interested in coming to France, but who have a lot of questions regarding moving to Paris and visas and application processes and all of that stuff. So my email is down in the description box below. So you know where to find me. <laughs> and without any further ado, we're gonna go to our first place today. So I know that when a tourist comes to Paris, their first instinct is to go shopping somewhere like Champs-Élysées, Galerie Lafayette, Boulevard Haussmann, Grand Boulevard, and I agree. These are nice places where you can shop, but if you want to explore a little bit, I am going to show you a shopping center that is actually, I think it's not very known among tourists, but it is a shopping center called Val d'Europe. And basically it's famous for um, selling a lot of designer brands for a cheaper price from the previous collection. If you're interested in getting some designer stuff, I would recommend you to not go to Champs-Élysées where everything is super expensive, but um, check out Valley Village and Val d'Europe. So we're going to go there today. I'm going to go there first because I actually have um, I actually have to buy a gift basically for someone. I'm gonna go and look around and see what I can buy. And that's uh, that's pretty much it. So without any further ado, let's go shopping. museum is always booked but there's no one here so they also gave me like these headphones where i can listen to like the tour guide speaking but i don't think i'm gonna use it so as you can see it's a beautiful museum let's look around Thank you. 
so freaking fancy. So what you can see here is Place de la Concorde, Eiffel Tower, Jardin des Tuileries. I think I'm not sure, but I guess from here it's a good way to see it all, to see all you have to see. The weather is so hot, but it's like super pretty, so I'm really glad I came. It's a really nice view, so. So I was just out, like coming back from the museum, and I met a subscriber. Hi. What's your name? My name is Antonia. And where are you from? I'm from Cyprus. Oh, thank you so much for coming up to me. You're welcome. You're you're so great. Videos <laughs> are wonderful. Oh, thank you. Oh. I've been watching them since um, 2019. Oh, that's a long time. Wow. Yeah, even before I came to Paris. Oh, and oh, like you wanted to come to Paris like even before or? Yeah, I did, but you like motivated me. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> Summers catching fireflies and winters on our skates.